What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Weed Boots. Alright, I've tried to record a couple of episodes before this and I had a little bit of problems with the program I was using. Uh, it's called Mirror Go and um, every time I record, everything goes fine. Like I'm recording in full screen just like I am right now. I was recording in small screen either way that I did it. Once I was done recording, I'd hit the stop recording button and it says, okay, your video has been recorded. Oops, there's been an unexpected error. The video has been saved. You go to the directory where the video is, there's nothing there. So all I have is a bunch of audio and no video. So what I'm doing is I'm using my traditional setup, which is uh, still the Mirror Go program, but I'm using OBS to do the recording. So I don't trust the other software, so I always stick with OBS because it works. So here we are this time. We're going to do full recording on this. We are going to stock up because we're a little bit low. Not overly, but probably grab about 30, say 35 of each. And I did speak with the devs. They told me going all the way up to 200% markup on some of these lower items, definitely not recommended. So, you know, maybe go around 140, 150, 130. So when you get into stuff like the chem dog, when you want to do the markup on that, say we go to uh, 45 for this one. Come on right there. We could go to 150. You know, maybe even a little bit higher, but the better the quality of the item, the more the markup you could do. Kind of makes sense, right? So as you can see, I've got my mouse here. I can and will be using the tap feature on my phone, just so that you guys know. So we can check out our stuff here. We got 84 items of that, and we got the edible gummy bear. I think what we should do is bring in some of this ditch weed and because there is a thing that also says like you should bring in stuff for uh the lower end of the market because not everybody has the big money so we'll do 130 percent markup on that as well and that should set us up we got 200 products available for use and let's jump into the game and see how we do today and uh there has been an update to the game so still not available on uh, Google Play or the Apple Store, but um, they have released an update which now includes different kinds of events like floods, um, tornadoes, bats, and um, I don't know if there's more in the way of robberies. Uh, you can get shakedown still, um, get threatened by gangs, by political parties, and that kind of stuff as well. Hey, we made 633 bucks that day. I don't even know how the fuck we did that. It felt like I was only open for two hours. All right, so that's the costs for us to operate. And Oh, and I hired a new girl. Because um, I had the, the college kid in there. This one here is an extra dollar an hour. And apparently she's supposed to be better for business. Because she's hot, but she's also drunk all the time. So she might not show up to work. I haven't experienced that yet. So I don't even know if it's a thing. But we got hippies here. And um, I'll also show you guys a bit of a glitch that happens as well. Uh, this is also for the devs so that they can see. So you can see I can click on these guys. And when I get into the... Um, right here. So you can see I've got the screen up. You can see the 1920 on the screen. See right down here where this is? Um, if I click on her... See, it sort of services her. There's another guy here. See, I'm collecting their money, but I'm actually not on the screen. So, that is a thing. Oops, see, doing it again. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Come on, get her. Oh, uh, almost got that last one. What did we do, like 78? 88. 880 dollar tip. Not too shabby. Well, we got one last person here. $19. Great news. University. Oh, shit, boy. Get ready to be serviced. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oops. There it is. Uh oh. Come on, get off the screen. No. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Whoa. That was a pretty damn good job. Look at the amount of money we got today. 
Holy shit. Oh, this huge influx of customers we're getting today. That's the third rush we've gotten. Mm hmm. Come on, get hit. And you. Yep. Got you, got you. Come on. Oh, we're getting all the multipliers. Oops. You sold out. Um, wow. So we'll do what? 60 of these guys? Okay. Get weed. 50. Yeah, 51, whatever. 130. And we go back to the chem dog. And sure. There we go. And that was all before lunch. God damn. Or is this a new day? Store is on fire. Oh shit, I've never had this one before. The more flames you extinguish, the less damage. And I just fucking restocked the store. Okay. Come on, get the fucking fire. So you're supposed to go around and tap all the fire and everything like that, so you can reduce the damage that is being taken. And go around. Oh, one more. There we go. How much did we do lose? 28 chem dogs. Fuck me. So we'll go back in here. Sure. There. Back to the store. Alright, how we doing? How we doing? How we doing? Nobody gonna come in. Hurry up and buy shit. I'm closing soon. Aw, oh, fucking just missed clicking on her because she's a little bitch. And, okay, so what do we get? 4,000, 1,700. We're not doing too bad. 64 customers. Damn. Um, daily profit, $2,300. That's the most that we've made. That's pretty badass. Congratulations, you just had your 10th profitable day. You just earned making bank badge. Ooh. And I think we're going to unlock something soon. Check the inventory. Sour Diesel unlocks in one day. Solid product, respectable high. Hard Candy unlocks in 31 days. AK-47, yeah, 151 days. That's an actual in-game daytime, by the way, just so you guys know. Um, let's see. Employees. Just earning some extra scratch until the circus is back in town. It's a bit cool. So this guy's actually better, but I don't know exactly what they do. See, we, that's the guy I fired. Just earning extra cash. Like, see, he's better, but how? What does this do for me? That's what I'd like to know. Uh, see, I don't get it. Super slick, fresh out of the lot. Supermodel, drop dead gorgeous. Regardless of what she's selling, I am buying. Hmm. That's weird. I don't really know. I'll have to look into that maybe at a different time. I ain't gonna hire him yet. Let's see how we do today. 900? Fuck off. Oh, that was cool. Give me your money. Mm hmm. Political shakedown 900? No. Oh, look at the fireworks. You have thwarted five shakedowns. Don't tread on me, badge. Nicely done, sir. Nicely done. Okay, there's that. Come on, get you, get you. Yeah, you. Yeah. We're getting a nice steady flow of people here. Insurance convention and everybody else leaves. Okay, 
got you, you, mm-hmm. I don't know what that means when their cash turns red like that. Mm-hmm. Come on. Go, 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 go. Two times, four times, you. Hillary Clinton's here too. Look at that, she spent 86 bucks. Good day, sir. Get out. Just in time to load oh, shit. Um Yeah, we thwarted two shakedowns that day too as well. 118 for stock. We should check our inventory. Congratulations, you've unlocked Sour Diesel by keeping your store in business for 29 days. Cool. Oh, they just completed your first month in business. You've earned your first month in business badge. Okay. Inventory. Uh, my products. What have we got? Gummy bear, 31, 31. So we should buy some more Kansas Stitch and gummy bears. And, yep. Sure. And do 130. And the gummy bears. These guys here. Yeah, why not? And 130. Now, Sour Diesel stocked the item. Uh, sure. And keep going. There we go. Finish there. Chem Dog. I'm not going to grab that much, but grab like 20 more. Yeah. Ooh. There we go. And back we go. Alright, I think this will probably end up being, well, we'll do two more days and then I'll call it an episode here. We'll hopefully get to see a few more of the little details that they do here. Hillary Clinton, is this for Bill? You're making a purchase for Bill. Uh, oh, we can't stop here. This is bat country. Save your product by tapping the bats. The more bats you tap, the less damage, or the more bats you tap, the less damage. Okay. Uh, and name that movie. Come on, guys. Give you two seconds, and then I'll I'll announce it. Fear and Loathing in Las Vegas. <laughs> oh, what a great movie. Okay, so we got these bats flying around. You, they're shaded, and you got to wait for them to turn dark black. And then you can tap them. And that'll get rid of the damage at 4% per tap that you actually get. And the more you tap the better off you are. And then we'll lose a whole bunch of shit. 36 gummy bears were lost in this attack. So we'll go there. There. Why not? Might as well refill. So I almost got 300 pieces in stock. Which no matter what happens, I'm going to be able to handle it. And last two customers, what are you going to buy? Okay, good, you, hurry, 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 hurry. Ah, oh, see, motherfucker. <laughs> all right, lost $428, only because we spent a shitload, but, all right, and this is one thing here, guys, so if you click on this turn off ad, you can either watch it, or you can turn it, click on the turn off, watch what happens here. It'll bring up another option. Turn off ads, you can disable viewing ads. You'll still have the option to view ads in exchange for store cash, but you turn off the ads for 99 cents, or you can unlock the entire game for 4.99. So that's entirely up to you guys. Um, it's not like um, you don't have to pay if you don't want to kind of thing, but if you don't want the ads, you can pay to get those off, or you can unlock all the stuff that's in the entire game for five bucks. So if you really like the game, you want to support the devs, definitely go ahead and do this. It's just a nice way to say, hey, you know what? Thanks a lot, guys. You guys kick ass. I'm going to give you a little something something for doing what you're doing. So I'm going to click no thanks, watch an ad, and I'll be right back. All right, and here we are, guys. Back for one last day. Still got 297 pieces to sell. Hey, Hillary came back. And... Who else? Nailed it. Come on. There we go. 
get what kind of convention are in town. So there's the light bulb up the top. You're missing customers. Once a customer is ready to check out, they only have a short amount of time before they get frustrated and leave the store. So I'm guessing that's where the one exclamation point comes from, or two, the red dollar sign. And I've been trying to tap them like crazy, but fuck you. I'm doing the best I can, all right? Leave me alone. So we got him. Yeah, I'm gonna try using the mouse and see what happens there. Okay, I'm clicking on you. Okay, clicking on you. There's that guy. Yep, got, Oh, missed you. Okay, we see, here's the thing here. You can, if you'd like to earn 333 for watching an advertisement, you can watch it. And this is what would still happen if you guys paid that $5 or 99 cents. Uh, you'd still be able to watch it. You can go, nah, fuck it, I'm gonna skip. Let's just do one more day, okay? I'm gonna, okay, there's the light bulb again. Selling out. You want to be careful not to totally sell out a product when you're when you sell it completely. You lose all customers in the store, and I always try to restock before selling out. Oh, I got 266 pieces. I think I'm pretty good. We don't have to worry about that kind of shit in my store. Are you done? Come on, click that motherfucker. Jesus. Who's next? There it is. Oh, see, she walked out, and I clicked on her, and it was like, no, nope, fuck you. You don't get my money. Great news. Okay. Oops. Come on. I don't know why it keeps popping up like that, and then I can't click on anything until this fucking thing leaves. Fine, I'll cheat. Mafia Shakedown? No. $1,200? Thanks. And everybody left. Fuck you, what a great way to end the episode. Well, we got a nice little tip anyways. Lost $1,200, got 700 back, so... Holy shit, we got another rush. Not yet, sir. Oh, and there's the end of the game. Lost $650, yeah, only because we had that fucking $1,200 shakedown. Fucking bullshit. Anyways, guys, I really hope you're enjoying this game. Like I said, all the links will be in the description. I'm not sponsored, not getting paid by these guys or anything like that. So once the game is released, there will be a link in the description so you guys can go check it out. I can't remember the exact date right offhand, but I'll try to put it in the description down below. I believe it's around November the 8th-ish. So just look down below. Hopefully you'll get to see it there. If you don't see it, remind me and I'll let you guys know. So I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys next time. Take care.